traditional surfboards are very toxically made. We figured out a way and a system. So I straight up got a high density plastic shredder and figured out if we can shred all of our waste, then we can at least upcycle it. So I'm a pioneer in that regard too. Like we're doing all this crazy stuff. Surfing in Southern California as a black man, I didn't have any like gnarly altercations, but something even more like, damn, what? You surf? Y'all don't even swim. Stuff like that, you know? I live in a part of Los Angeles that does not have that many black people at the beach. In my opinion, we're fortunate that the BLM happened this past summer. Now, case in point, I'm at the beach. I'm not the only black surfer. And I don't know every black surfer there. And what had happened was a couple people reached out, saw the same thing and said, hey, Ryan, you're a leader in this community. Let's do a paddle out for George Floyd right in the middle of Manhattan Beach. It's predominantly white. Let's do it. I think the number one thing is continue to talk story and share stories. Anybody in this space that's an only, you don't have to be. 